again, so today is a Japanese taste test and we are taste testing these snackers I got sent in my sister crate Woo. which comes from my big sister if you guys don't know already and I will link that video down below if you have not watched the unboxing for that. Now we have quite a few things to get through, a decent amount. Um, we got some chocolate in my bow, I've never had chocolate in my bow. Me neither. Uh, ever. <laughs> And we also got like loads of corn potage. If you guys have watched the unboxing video, you'll know that we got sent a 60 pack. Well, I got sent a 60 pack. Oh, uh, yeah. And we've already eaten some of these, but we figured we'd just sort of do a sort of mini review on it anyway, because I just wanted to eat one. So. They're very nice. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, yes. Now, the way we do it with our taste test is that we go sweet and savory. I think we do have a majority of. Actually, it might be evenly balanced. I think balanced. it looks relatively even. Yeah. It's relatively evenly balanced, but there's a lot of good stuff to eat. Do you want to try something again? Uh, should we start off with the pretz? The pretz? The pretz. Now, which kind of pretz is that? Do you want to show the good folk at home? Pretz. If it will focus. There we go. Ah, uh, it's the corn flavoured pretz, yeah. which she says sweet corn. It's got a big, big sweet corn on the front. It does. We can't go wrong with pretz because I also mentioned to her that I really like the corn potage flavour. Evan also just really likes corn I do. flavor because you can't go far wrong with corn. Because he's weird like that, yeah, no. Yeah, corn. Jump. Hmm. It's not overpoweringly corn. No. And there's a slightly buttery flavor. But I'd say it's quite more. Um, hmm. I don't know. I want more corn flavor. You want it to be stronger. I think we've been spoiled by the Umibo sticks, which are really. Yeah. They're really corn. Cool. This reminds me of something actually, but I can't think what. I quite like it. It tastes like the base pretz you would get. Pretz have been hit and miss for me so far, so. But with, yeah. Evan has a very picky palette. I still haven't quite figured out what his palette is like, to be honest. <laughs> me He's neither. the kind of person who doesn't like butter no. or sauce. He ate oh. a muffin the other day. <laughs> well, this isn't an English muffin, like the weird bread thing. He ate a weird bread thing, just plain. And those things are designed for condiments, okay? I was freaked out. I was freaked out. He ate the entire packet one day. I don't need to explain myself to anyone. <laughs> I was disgusted. <laughs> I like these, they're good. Mm. They're good, but not up there with the corn expectations. Ooh. Yeah. Scathing reviews. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want more corn. More. <laughs> okay, baby, you're fine. Right, so we might as well keep going on the stick trend and we'll go with this banana and chocolate pocky. Binoclate? Binoclate. Chabana? <laughs> Binocle or Chibana? Leave your comments down below. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's like the cookie part is chocolate and it's dipped in the banana flavoured white chocolate. Ooh, Ooh. white chocolate. No, I like white chocolate. I like lot. chocolate. It is my preferred chocolate. If I don't destroy the packaging completely. Oh, there we go. I mean, I got scissors for a reason. <laughs> you did. Wow. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You got most of the cookie part, what does that taste like to you? I don't really notice because it all kind of, I lumped it in one giant mouthful. It does, it. it looks really cute though. Like Considering I don't like banana, I do like this quite a lot. It's really cute. I just like how it looks. You know how it looks? It looks kind of retro, I guess. Yeah, what? <gasps> I am vacuuming after this, mm -mm. obviously. My room needs to vacuum, it's covered mm -mm. in like fluff and stuff in there. <laughs> just drinking our own filth in here. Everyone's the one who made it filthy when he came over. Okay. <laughs> These are nice. Yeah, they're all right. Yeah. I think I'm more on the move for savory stuff. I mean, we eat, we're going to be eating garlic bread after we've done all our taste tests. <laughs> yep. We've got. We're filming another taste test after this, so. Thumbs up for a garlic bread tuned. taste test. <laughs> <laughs> Not that. <laughs> hey guys, today we're taste testing the garlic bread. Mmm, it's tasty. <laughs> Okay, um, I guess sweet next? No, we just had sweet. That was sweet? Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay, fine. You tell me bananas and chocolate would not be a sweet thing. What the fuck, babe? My, my, my standards of sweet are clearly out of this realm. Let's go with these. Shrimp, shrimp chips. Shrimp chips. Chip shrimp. Ow! Did I actually stab you? <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> it was more like it, I think it caught a hair on my arm and it just like pulled it. Crunchy savory shrimp chips. And I think I need it them. says I love these chips even if they smell fishy, these are some delicious chips. I never really showed you guys the booklet, but every time my sis sends us sends the sister crate, she makes her a little booklet for it, which I think is super cute. Ooh, they're like thick things. Ooh, they're like corn crackers. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. 
called? Yeah, I went in like thinking. Because you know, you see that, no. You see that and you think prawn cracker flavor. But it's not the prawn cracker flavor, it's not like the standard one. I don't know if it would taste different. It tastes in kind of to me like a um, bit like prawn cocktail crisps, yeah? Well, it's very nice. Hmm. I like it a lot. I don't know if the prawn cocktail but more mellow. Good call. Yeah. We've tried the prawn cocktail crisps, not necessarily the Walkers ones. There was like the other ones, which were like crunchy, same but texture as this. Mm. But they were really like quavers, I think. Really, I don't know, but once you touched them, they were like really strong and yeah. like that shot acidity, whatever it was. Look at me, I'm using fancy terms. Oh, <laughs> go to my restaurant. Do you want uh -huh. me to do a review for you? <laughs> acidity on the crisps. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we should probably not eat the whole packet now, but I quite easily could, you know? Yeah. Mm. I wish you were a bit stronger. I want another one. Mm. Mm. Another? Another one. Mm -hmm. mm. I don't know if you can take it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> right, well. Comment down below if you know which song that was. And win a VIP tour of somewhere. Oh no, 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 we're not, no, 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 no winnings here, it's just, it's just street cred, street cred. Street cred, oh. <laughs> kitten points. <laughs> what happens when you get 100 kitten points? Um, um, I will personally break into a house and give you a hug. I, I don't know. But when you least expect it. Yeah, but when you least expect it, you're brushing your teeth by breaking through your window. <laughs> I'm here! I don't know why I'm saying that, I don't like hugs. Oh. But I do, but it depends. I, I'll go in your place, it's fine. <laughs> no, I don't, think like, any, this man? I don't think any of my kittens will want to be hugged by you, you Aww. creepy child. Sad face. <laughs> you can't hug them anyway because you're mine. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we had savory. We did. Let's try the Whoa. chocolate on my buff. Now, I'm thinking it's going to taste like, you know, the cocoa puff, not the cocoa puffs, the chocolate rice krispies. Yes. I have a feeling, what well, I feel as though it might taste like that. Oh. But like, I don't, I don't know. They're like really little boys. Compared to a normal Umaiba stick, yeah, yeah, they're quite small, you see. They're like little children. I am excited to consume my chocolate. Me too, it's wrapped in chocolate. Whoa! Wrapped in Whoa! chocolate. Look at that. Whoa! It's like a cake what? bar or something. What? I was not expecting <laughs> that. I thought it was going to be like... Chocolatey biscuit stuff. Yeah. Ooh, wrappers, where are we? Um, we didn't bring the bin over here. We we'll didn't. Just put it over there. No, I'm yep. going to throw this away too, so remind <gasps> Literally, let me tell you a story about the... I don't know if you guys can see it. Mm. The, I've got like this, yeah, this right here. Oh, it's right. actually decomposing. So I need to throw it away, I just keep forgetting. <laughs> hmm. So I was expecting it to be like a wafer, but a chocolate wafer, but it's like just the chocolate covered wafer. Hmm. What are your opinions? Hmm. The thing to note is that Japanese chocolate tastes very different I like to it. any other kind but of chocolate. It kind of reminds me of like drink chocolate. Does that make sense at all? Drink hot chocolate's weak though. Mmm, but it's kind of, to me it tastes like if I've ordered like a hot chocolate in a different country or something. It kind of reminds me of that flavor. Weird specific, I know. But I'm seeming to remember having like milkshakes in Greece or something and it tasted a lot like that. <laughs> I like it basically, it's good. <laughs> um, it's kind of mild, but like. I'm like. Yeah, I think it could stand to be a bit chocolatey there, but. Yeah, you could take a few of these with you. I can take a few of these with <laughs> <laughs> you. I, I like it anyways, but yes. Right, um, next we're on to Savara. Savara. Savoir. Savoir. Uh, what's in that box there? That's chocolate. Okay, in that case, we will go with the tempuras. Incidentally, we picked some of these up ourselves from the Asian store. Mm. So it's interesting that they have it as well. This also has a resealable sip of this, so it's handy. Woohoo! Wait, we still have the other one that's open too that we need to eat. Yep. Love. Rappers. But yeah, I like seaweed. And I like tempura. I actually used to really love these, but I went off them. This was about roughly five, six years ago. And they look like So seaweed. I'm pretty sure my opinion on them will have probably changed by now. So. Mm. Mm. Solid. I love it. It's delicious. It's good. It is really, really like, there's a sort of warmth to it as well, I think. It's a little bit of spice. Yeah. Because, mm. mm. um,. My big sis said that she got us the least spicy ones because she knows I don't do well with spice. But, um, yeah, it's a tempura nori, a delicious and unique snack. It has a crunchy bean deep fried with some tempura batter on it. Yes. This is the original flavor and what looked like the most mild flavor. <laughs> I'm glad it was mild because I'm not like a super, super spicy fan. I don't know why I went off these. Maybe it's just like too many. No such thing. I could just eat these forever. 
It does get all over your hands when you reach into the packet, though. Is what That's I'm why I'm making him yeah. feed me. My, my hands like got loads of little like flakes on it. Wow. Mm -hmm. Babe, show me your teeth. Mm. Yeah, you got something stuck in your teeth. <laughs> I'll spend the rest of the video talking like this. <laughs> no, babe, just lick your teeth. Mm -hmm. Ding. <laughs> now here's a seaweed! Wait, no, I want more. More? More! More? <laughs> more? Please, uh, I want some more. Uh, I'm trying not to like destroy all of them on the way out. That looks like a thick one. Um, mm. It's good! Delicious. Crunchy. Because mm -hmm. there's another version with just to see. Wait, seal it. Seal it? I'm gonna sing and just lick my face. As I said, because there is the other flavour which is just the seaweed, no, which no I do crisp. quite like, but no I like both of them really. I prefer this one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jelly! Je 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 jelly! Babe! <laughs> jelly! I had hiccups the other day and I was saying it's like someone was like remixing your words, so I was looking down like je jelly. <laughs> These are squeeze and bites. And this is lychee flavour. Yum yum. It's funny because I still have a tub of jelly in the fridge which needs to be eaten today. So mm. I'm going to be eating a lot of jelly. I ate jelly yesterday as well. When my mum was pregnant with me, jelly? she was craving lychees, I think. Really? So these are like my spirit fruit, you know? Here you go. <laughs> so you squeeze them and then you eat them. Wait, so I squeeze it. And they it. look like what? this. What? you got to open it first, obviously. But they I went look squeezing like this. it like shoot it all out? No, babe. And it's got like lychee bits in it. I think I know. We need the bin. Babe, can you get the bin, please? No, because I'm under you. You need to go get the bin. No. But I can't. Okay, if you open this, I will get the bin. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you can take it. Whoa, why are these so hard to uh, open? <laughs> Shut up, continue. <laughs> why are these so hard to uh, open? <laughs> Now you can put some of the rubage away. Garbage. The rubage. A rubé. The bin's like getting quite full. Whoa, this is so tough to open. WTF. You'd expect like. I thought I was just being pathetic. You'd think a snacker like this would be like easily openable, but. We're gonna get jelly incorrect. on the carpet. Long. Can you vacuum jelly? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Try that again. Yeah. I'm kinda... It's like. Oh, I think maybe yours is just hard. Oh wait, am I, am I getting somewhere? Am I getting, am I getting somewhere? Oh, babes is just really hard because I've oh. it. <laughs> yeah, mine's like super gluey. I think should I just move on to a different one? <laughs> no, babe. But this is clearly not going anywhere. If you're wondering what I'm doing, as you guys know, with jelly, you always have that, that liquid which hasn't quite all set. So I'm slurping it as I go so I don't get it everywhere. Cause I feel like this is going to go everywhere if I do get it open. Gambate! <laughs> no, I don't think I should. <laughs> I believe. And it says you squeeze it. Where do you squeeze it? Is there a demonstration of this? Show me a demonstration. No, you, it just says just squeeze it and then... Ugh. I'm trying to see if squeezing it does anything. Where are the scissors? I think it's like squeeze... Ah! Can you guys see? It's rising up. Rise up! You gotta rise up. Oh. <gasps> I think I'm. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> babe, look, I did it. Oh, really good texture, jelly. Mm. I did it, babe. Mm. That was, yeah, surprisingly easy. I thought so, it might be a little bit harder, but I guess its name is Squeeze and Bite, so it is indeed easier to open. Uh, I'm only just getting the lid off mine. Do you like it? I like lychee, I also like jelly. So, yes. Oh. <laughs> I have finally got mine open. So, how would I do? Just squeeze. Squeeze? It's gonna like go everywhere, isn't it? There's like squeeze gently and then slurp it in and bite. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could have gotten a close up of Evan doing that. It was so funny just watching it. <laughs> On the plus side, it was very tasty. <laughs> Was it worth opening for like 10 minutes? I wonder. Well, it, it, you, just got, yeah. you just got particularly hard on my thing. Okay, <sighs> so 
We might as well. Because we mostly we just have sweet things left, but we do have one more thing, which is one more savory thing, which is our uh, corn potage umaibo. Now, we've already been snacking on these, but. Oh, you can't resist. But we were just like. We'll just eat one anyway, because they're tasty and. Yes. And beautiful and wholesome. Like, babe. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Tastes like corn potage. Oh yeah. It's all the corn you want. <laughs> it's absolutely. <laughs> it's strong, it's flavoursome, it's sweet. It's safe. I wonder who invented a Mm-hmm. Like, how did they come up with the idea? Because there's so many different flavours of a Maibo as well. Monsieur Maibo in 1836. Um <laughs> oh, babe. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Yeah, definitely gonna have to vacuum after this. Mm -hmm. I think I've got something on my glasses because there's a sm this blurry bit right here. That's your hair. Is it? Mm -hmm. well, I don't know if I can get it out. Uh... <laughs> you can't do it, babe. <laughs> it's like all tangled in the decoration. Yeah. That looks better. It's still a blurry thing. Babe's getting more short sighted, you think? Mm -hmm. <laughs> like. Oh wow, I've so many fingerprints. Like, if any glasses <laughs> user will be able to sympathize, like, it is so hard to keep the glasses clean. Mm -hmm. And sometimes you just end up going through your day slightly blurry because you've got like a smudge right across your lens. Like, legit, that happens to me all the time. Aww. Sometimes I'm like, I go outside and I'm like, is it foggy or is there just a smudge on my glasses? <laughs> we could go chocolate none, chocolate none here. We could, because what we've got left is. Sweet. Two candies and two. Chocolata. Chocolata thingies. So, let's go with these. Chocolate mushrooms, man. Chocolate mushrooms, which are... I can't find it in the book, never mind, let's just eat them. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> and a stranger offers you mushrooms, don't take them. I'm pretty sure if you guys want to get your hands on this particular one, I'm pretty sure Tofu Q does these. I think I've seen them on the Instagram page. <gasps> Ooh, that's so cute. That was like really cute packaging. I like, Food, to me, tastes better if it looks pretty. I guess, yeah, true. There it is. It's how I can deal with kissing your face. Wait, because <laughs> it looks pretty? I mean... <laughs> Weird backhanded compliment? I, I, I was like, mark. yeah, was, it took me a minute to like give them... <laughs> um... Yeah. Through strength. Ooh! Oh my god, cute. that looks funny. They're like, cute. Yeah. Like, little... Very like, silly. yeah. You guys we should actually that. hold them up. Yeah. Oh, that's like three stuck together. <laughs> They're kind of. They've become an amalgam. Yeah, I've got a normal one there. You, you don't. You, the amalgam is more interesting. Though. Oh please. <laughs> Everyone wants to see the amalgam, don't they? Ha. <laughs> huh. Doesn't taste very chocolatey. Basically. Try a single one rather than three before you give your opinion. I think. Basically, <laughs> it's just like a little stick. Going into some chocolate. Yeah. Well, pretty standard tasty snacker. I can't really taste the chocolate if I'm honest. Try eating more at once. <laughs> 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 nah, that'll be a waste. I, um, these are your snackers. I know. Is I do it no, it's no. not. Oh my god. No, you can, you can eat more. <laughs> no. Usually I'm sort of like on chocolate snackers because I like chocolate but I prefer candy over chocolate. Yeah. And if I eat chocolate, I like it to be white chocolate. Well. I'm oddly specific like that, but when it comes to candy, I don't discriminate. She says I've got a weird palate. <laughs> These are normal. Yeah. Um, I but think not having of... sauce, no raw sauce, sauce <laughs> is not normal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so a candy next. Oh, babe, your hands are so cold. Ugh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with this strawberry thing. Strawberry ting. It's a strawberry and milk candy. It says outer shells, hard strawberry candy, and a brittle milk flavored center. Heck yeah. Ah! Ah! Well, that was at the gym before, right? Ah! Oh shit. I was gonna, I was trying to uh... preserve this packaging, but I just ripped it. How oh, in any way was that preserving the packaging, yeah, babe? babe. <laughs> I was trying to like get the viewers hyped. Were you no. guys hyped? I yes. was hyped. Yes, you were. It looked nice as well. Mm. It's got like a little triangle on it. Mine's and then a really, on it. They're in the region package and they look super, super, super cute. Oh! Oh! You're quenching already? Oh! Mm. I was trying to open it to show you guys and it looks like this. 
cute little, mm -hmm. cute little thingy right there. Yeah. Oh. For all 9,000 taste buds. We have more than 9,000. Actually, I don't know how many taste buds we have. I'm just talking out my ass at this point. <laughs> I'm just going after that like video of the cake sester guy in the swing. <laughs> I don't have to show you. <laughs> I like this, by the way. That's kind of... Uh, Ew! I don't know. I ever need these too fast. I don't like crunching my candies. Don't you? If it's a hard candy, I like... I, I savor it, you know, because that's what they're meant to be for. Yeah, but we'd be here forever if we did that with a little... That's why I give it. Yeah. That's why I give it to you. <laughs> okay, so while Evan is consuming that, we're gonna move on to yam yim, yam yam, yam yam. <laughs> Shut up! I couldn't remember what it was called. And I was trying to read it backwards in the viewfinder. It is yam yam, which is looks like a dippy dippy thing. Mm -hmm. Take the biscuit and you dip it in the chocolate and then you eat it. Pretty self-explanatory. Looks like the thingies have like names. The sticks have like creature names on it and stuff. As you can see, Kato, Mausu. That's the flavors, clearly. Yes. Cat flavored stick. You've already had cat flavor yesterday, babe. Hey. 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 This is a child channel PG rated. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ew. Oh. Stop. You're telling me that if you didn't get the stuff in the lid, you wouldn't lick it. My, I've got rabbit, and it says, eat more carrots on it. <laughs> they actually have sayings on it? It's got like, advice on it or something? Does it? That's so funny. <laughs> I've got duck. Quack, quack, never mind. It literally just says duck. Babe. Quack, quack, quack. We have, a, we have a slight issue. The chocolate's like solid. I uh, know. Yeah, because it's quite cold in my room. So oh. I did foresee this. <sighs> <laughs> tries, to, tries to warm up the chocolate. <laughs> just use brute force. Mm. It's like when you get ice cream out of the freezer too early and it's just like... I got some. Yeah. I'm going mining. Mm. Where's the stick? Freezer with the... Um... See, when I used to have like dipping things like that, I would always just then like eat the rest of whatever I had in dips. These are nice. They're like little bread sticks. Yeah. Oh, I got duck quack quack as well. Oh. What was that? What was that YouTube thing? A long, long, long time ago, way back when YouTube was doing the startup. That was that like duck thing. The duck. Have you got any grapes? That one. The duck with the grapes. Do you remember? Do you got? Do any of you guys remember that? Google who? There was a duck with the grapes, and he went to the hardware store, and he said, "Do you have any grapes?" And I just kind of ended up the shopkeeper get do get really pissed off or something. I can't remember. <laughs> You're older than me! Yeah, I just played video games. <laughs> I was a fucking nerd. <laughs> I'm a, I was and am a nerd. Alright, and we're gonna finish off with Evan's favorite. White Rabbit. I happen to have had a lot, a, a, a lot of these in my time. Now, if you guys recall my last Japanese taste test from the crate, um, my big sister sent me the matcha one, which I did not get along with. <laughs> <laughs> I think it traveled bad and it was like rock solid and I was like ah. Even if these but were rock solid, I think I'd still love them. Hopefully oh. these should be pretty Gucci. Now they're milk flavored and they are wrapped in edible paper. Edible rice paper, but you gotta take off the outer layer, but this bit is the edible part. Wow. So. It's solid. It's solid. Actually it's not. Oh, so hard. No, it's not. Just bite harder. I'll take it in a second, babe. Just come on. You actually have to have a go. <laughs> No, babe! I took away my mouth! Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Have you guys noticed I just don't have chew tolerance? Or whatever. I don't know! It's like sometimes, like, if it's going to be a labor intensive food, I have to be in the mood to consume the labor intensive food. You feel? She's got tiny, weak jaws, is what she's trying to say. Well, yeah. <laughs> Why would I have strong jaws? Big, strong jaws. Like, every day I chew, like, 50 chewing gums uh -huh. to strengthen my jaw. So I can... Catch me with strong. dumbbells hanging off my, like, lips, like... <laughs> so disturbing. I need to eat some cornbread. No. What? This isn't an eat test, it's a taste test. You already tasted the cornbread. Ooh, it's so tasty. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm. 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 Okay. You, can you speak enough, babe, or are you still okay? 
Labor intensive. That's why I'm saying, why are you eating those? You need to talk to the people. I can talk and speak. Talk and speak. I can eat and speak. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, evidently. <laughs> so guys, a fun fact about Evan. Um. He really, 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 really likes me. Mm. <laughs> fun fact for you guys, in case you didn't know. She's all right. Um, excuse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you capable of speaking now? Yes. Okay, it's another part of the video where we choose our favourites. I think, right? Yeah, yeah. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> You've shot enough of these with me that you should yeah, know. Yeah, I should know. And what we do with our taste test is that we choose our favourite savoury item and our favourite sweet item. Now, because we both love the corner Myra so much, we're not allowed to choose that as a favourite savoury. Well, I wasn't even thinking of it. Oh, were you not? I wasn't. Oh, no. Okay. I think. So you go first. Yeah, in terms of sweet, it's kind of like predictable, but I will have to say the white rabbit because like I could literally eat like Base. barrels and barrels of these. Like with <laughs> me, but, I'm gonna go yeah. with our jelly because it's slightly flavor. I love jelly, so yeah, that and already it already puts it up there for me. That's a savory. It's kind of a difficult choice actually because like. I think a lot of these savory things were really nice, including those pretzels you're just having all of. All right, I'll put that down. Stop it. <laughs> I, I think these, however, like took the cake for me. They're delicious. Tempura. The high tempura. Mm. Hmm. Mm. I'm kind of like I quite like these ones. The one I'm eating right now. So I'm kind of not a mix. Oh wow, there's not many left. Okay, you can finish it. I'm just kidding. No, I'm just kidding. No, I'm seriously. You can finish it. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna go with the tempura as well, actually. That's a 10. I'm trying to think, because it's really quite interesting because when you're younger and um, when you're older, your taste buds will always change. Well, your body's always constantly changing in many ways. But the most interesting thing to me is how your taste palette can change drastically. It's like, I hated mushrooms as a kid. I don't mind them too much now, but I really love Chinese mushrooms. Or like children with coffee in general, right? Mm, it's like that. And it's like with the tempura thing, like I just um, went off it suddenly, like randomly. And I used to go through like a giant seaweed binge. So if you guys have any interesting stories relating to what you used to hate, but what you love now, but what you used to love, but what you hate now in, in regards to food, let us know down below, because I always find it so weird. Like me with rum. Rum? <laughs> I remember drinking it when I was young and thinking, what is this? It's like petrol. <laughs> now I'm just like, yeah. Don't drink until you're of legal age to drink, kids. <laughs> Babe, like, what weird. are you doing? <laughs> you're poisoning my kittens. I, ignore that story, it was all lies. I'm, <laughs> No, kids, okay, so I'm gonna say if you do drink, make sure you do it in a controlled manner and don't over drink. And if you it's think just, you it, drink too much, tell someone yeah. you trust and they will look after you. It was just a zip of like granddad's room, I think. Another thing, and another thing for any of y'all young party goers, don't mix alcohol and weed. I've been there and done that. It's not fun, don't do it. Look after yourselves. I advocate for good, sensible behavior, which is uh, drinking sensibly when you're of age to drink and not doing uh, drugs. drugs. The only drug I need is Evan. He's pretty lame. That was a half-hearted compliment. <laughs> Fine, so you don't want my compliments? I want your compliments. You have to step up your game, babe. So you don't want Kisu instead? Of course I do. Too late. <gasps> Can I make Kisu? Yep. <laughs> you see, I have a rule where it's like, minimum of three Kisu. PG or channel. you die. PG. Anyway. If you guys had any favourites or if you've tried anything that we've tried today, let us know down below. If you have a favourite Mybo stick flavour, let us know. Mm. I would say, like, I don't know, we've tried several different ones and we haven't always known what the name or what the flavour <laughs> was. That's the hard was. part. It's like, this so it's like, flavor. Yeah, there's like so many different Mybo out there that we find really, really tasty. Mm. But it could be anything, though. Okay, we cut off and I think we were talking about Mybo. Mybo, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I was saying how... I'd really like to get like a mix pack of Amiibo so I can like pinpoint our favorite flavors. Just a giant like piano with like each key is Amiibo. <laughs> because then you guys can just send us your Amiibo to try. Yeah. But yeah. <coughs> Did I say don't forget to give this video a thumbs up? No, you didn't. Well, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching us do a taste test. If you ever have any recommendations of weird things you want to see us taste test, uh, let us know down in the comments below. Ew. What? I just ate food. What do you expect? Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> And if you're not subscribed and you would like to be, hit that subscribe button. Join the family of kittens. Because yes, they what the fuck. We're meant to be adorable. And being like a hamster instead. Because yes, they're adorable. <laughs> this one, this is not part, this this is not kitten. And the ugly part. kitten. Ew. The ugly kitten. <laughs> All my social media links are down below, so check that out if you would like. 
And if you're subscribed to my Instagram, you've seen a sneak peek of this video because you know we like to get a little bit meta on this channel. Although by the time that this video goes up, that will be a fairly old post. Mm. But kudos to anyone who recognizes the particular post. Because I know some of y'all do keep tracks on that. Good. The hardcore fans, you know. Mm -hmm. And the the stalker like too, maybe. <laughs> and a few stalkers, whatever. <laughs> Props to you guys. <laughs> <laughs> and if you like, please put me on my Patreon. Just one dollar goes a long way, and I appreciate it very, very much. But as always, hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> click the circular channel icon to subscribe. To watch more videos, click any of the videos down below. See you in my next one.